Today we have a really interesting topic entitled Breaking the Chains of Addiction and Harmful Habits. That's heavy. In fact, the whole topic of addiction is deeply personal to me, particularly because my older brother died an early death because his life was filled with drugs and alcohol abuse. So when I hear this topic, I get triggered and I miss my brother. And I know some people who really struggle with this and this is hard. But then I began to think, wow, not everybody has an addiction to some chemical substance that has basically taken over their body and begun to destroy their mind. Some people are addicted to abusing other stuff. <laughs> I'm laughing because I abuse food. I love to overeat. And it's got me into some weight problems, but I've changed some of that. I had a friend though that had just the opposite of it. Eating disorders. And that was so painful to be addicted not to eat. Wow. Maybe some of you are, you don't need to raise your hand right now, are addicted to some of that secret addictions like pornography. Hmm. Or, frankly, the more public addiction to just binging on Netflix. <laughs> or check your phone. See how many hours you're spending on social media, scrolling, scrolling, swiping left. It's an addiction. It could take over your life. So all addiction and recovery programs have 12 steps. And, you know, I'm just going to break down a couple steps that help us with overcoming addictions. The first one is that you just got to admit that you're powerless over that addiction. Paul even admitted that he needed help. In Romans chapter 7, verse 18, he says, For I have the desire to do what is good, but I cannot carry it out. Wow. Have you been there? I've been there. The second step to breaking the chains of addiction and, and crazy habits, once you admit it, secondly, is to believe that God has the power to restore you. Again, Paul writes in Philippians chapter 2, verse 13, for it is God who works in you to will and to act according to his good purpose. So take these two most important steps towards your recovery today. I want to pray with you. Lord, help these and people who are watching and myself, that when we fall into crazy habits or it even becomes addictive, that we can believe by the confession of our mouth that we can't do it and the belief in our heart that you can restore all things. In Jesus' name, amen.